Welcome to How to Starch Military Uniforms, presented by Training Center Cape May. I'm Chief Snyder, and Petty Officer Gunn and Petty Officer Hardy will be demonstrating how to starch both operational and dress military uniforms using either concentrated liquid starch or spray starch in a can. Starch the operational dress uniform, which is similar to most other operational military uniforms. Start with a uniform that is still damp from the washing machine after a spin cycle and turn it inside out. Using an industrial spray bottle that can be purchased at most home improvement stores, fill the bottle with a 50-50 mixture of concentrated liquid starch and water and shake to mix. If you prefer, you can use spray starch in a can instead, but the concentrated starch tends to be more economical. Spray the starch mixture on the damp garment evenly. The amount of starch you use will dictate how stiff the dried uniform will turn out. Be sure to spray in between the button cover on the front of the blouse and the inside of the lapels, which are typically the most difficult parts of the uniform to keep flat. Repeat this same method on the operational trousers. Dried starch can be hazardous on floors. We recommend doing this in the bathroom or basement with towels on the floor or outside. I personally use concentrated starch after a uniform is washed or cleaned and then use spray starch in a can on a dry uniform in between wears, especially in the summer when the humidity makes it difficult to keep a starched uniform. To starch dress uniforms, use the same technique. With a wet blouse inside out, soak the garment with a 50-50 mixture of concentrated liquid starch and water in an industrial spray bottle or with canned spray starch. We have found that the light blue dress shirts can be sprayed with a heavy coating of starch for a crisp military appearance. Many dry cleaners will not starch military dress pants, but we have had success using spray can starch on dry dress trousers and then ironing with a heat resistant iron guard or bandana. Once you have starched your garments, let them air dry and then iron with high heat, steam, and an iron shield as shown in our How to Iron Operational Dress Military Blouses. Thanks for watching.